So I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and setup and I'll show you how to set up with the Windows 10 laptop in the end we will do a test and a review. Now next step is to switch on the printer so press the power button and wait for the printer to start and to install the setup in cartridges we have number 243 black number 244 color and we have to take them out so simply open the seal from here and remove the orange seal which is at the bottom. To install the in cartridges open the in cartridge chamber door so you just have to push it outside check the color and the black marking here now the black will go here so you just have to slide it in so it's very easy and now hold the printer and press it with the force here will go the color press it with the force and it's installed now close the in cartridge chamber door load the A4 size sheets so the paper tray is on the top as you can see here and you can adjust the size with the size adjuster here place the A4 size sheets here so in the Windows 10 laptop we have to install the driver of this printer so you get these drivers in a CD so this is the Canon Pixima MG2500 series setup CD-ROM. So install it. Now open this disk and just click on the run setup. Click on yes and here we have to start the setup. So click on the next button. Select the place of residence. Click on the next button. Now select the drivers you want to load. You can select all and click on the next. Click on yes. Here we can see it says about the printer connection. So we have to connect the printer using the USB cable. So connect one end of the cable with your printer and the other end with your Windows 10. Next step is to do the print head alignment. So click on the execute button. Open the top scanner lid. Place the page facing downwards on the left hand side corner. And click on the color icon button here and it will start the alignment so once you finish the alignment you have to click on the next button and you will see your setup is complete so click on next again agree with the terms and conditions we can also print a test page here so click on that and we'll see the result for that and also the quality is good now click on next again and here it says installation completely successful click on the exit button to do the scanning we have to find the printer in the windows 10 laptop so go to the setting icon click on the devices and click on the printers and scanners and here we see Canon MG2500 series printer click on that 
you get option manage printer so click on manage here you see the printer again so scroll down and look for scanner Canon MG2500 series click on that click on open scanner and here we can start the scanning for that we can select the file type so we want it as a PDF so click on PDF and click on the scan icon at the bottom So we have finished the scanning, so click on the view icon. So here we can see, so we can reduce the size to see the full copy here. So here we can see this is the page we have converted into the PDF and we can save it or we can share it as well. Here we get the save option, click on that. So you will get option here. So if you want you can save it in a desktop. You can change the name of the file and select file as a PDF and click on the save button. So it is saved there. You can cancel this screen and you can close the scanner now. So here is the PDF on the screen which is a new PDF and this is the one we have just created. Yes. Overall I can say it's a very good printer for its price. You can do the printing and scanning and the good thing is like it's not a wireless printer and if you use USB printer the connection is secure it will work always. You don't have to switch it on switch it off again and again because sometimes the wireless printers go sleep and this printer is good in that sense. It has all three options copy print and scan. Overall it's a good printer for home or office use. Thanks for watching.